Hey guys, so today is Saturday and I am at the hair place. I'm gonna go get my hair cut. I'm super excited. I haven't had it cut since right before I had Noah, so that was back in December or January or something like that. And if you guys remember, I cut it pretty short and I think that's what I'm gonna do again this time. I loved it being short and every time I, well every time I, see this is the thing, every time I cut it short, I'm like, I like it and then I'm like, uh, I kind of miss my long hair and then I tell myself I'm not going to cut it short again. But then my hair grows out to how it is now. Let me show you how long. I feel like it's super long and it's getting super annoying. So then my hair gets this long again and it starts to really bug me. I start having to like wrap it up on top of my head when I want to get it up and it just starts to be a pain in the butt to wash and to dry and everything. and. Even though I kind of, I mean, it looks pretty. I think it looks really pretty right now, <laughs> but I'm still gonna cut it. I think I'm gonna go maybe a little bit longer than it was before, but probably gonna cut about that much off. So yeah, I'm really excited. It's gonna feel super nice. And this girl did a really good job last time. I'm going back to the same girl that I went to last time. She did really good layers in my hair, like really good chunky layers. That's like what my hair needs. Like. I don't know, my hair's really thick, so if you just take like a tiny little piece of hair and cut it a little bit, it's not gonna make a difference, like you really gotta cut it, so. She knows what she's doing, so yeah, I'm really excited. I wanted to do a little before shot, and then I'll show you guys the after, so here we go. And I'm also gonna have it colored, but that's not till next month. She's gonna do like more blonde for me, because it's pretty dark underneath, and I want it to be, I want it to be more blonde underneath and all over and everything, but. Yeah, so, here's the before. It's long. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna go in and I'll see you guys when I'm done. And I'm done. I love it. I think it looks amazing. It feels so much lighter and so much shorter and I just love it. I love cutting my hair short. It's so, and it feels so refreshing to chop your hair off, but yeah so that is what it looks like and again she gave me like the best layers and like she cut it like cut the layers into it and she blow dried it and she flat ironed it and then she even cut into the layers even more to like help it lay flatter <laughs> instead of like poofing out at the end like that's what my hair likes to do like at the end it will just like stick out so she chopped into those layers a little bit more and it looks amazing i'm so happy with it I love this girl, I swear, as long as she's cutting hair, I'm going to be going to her because when you find somebody good, there's no reason to go anywhere else. So as long as she's cutting hair, I'm going to go to her. Even if we move away, I'll just come back, get my hair cut, and then go back home, wherever that might be. <laughs> um, but anyway, I feel like a new mom, got myself a mom cut, and yeah, I'm going to run to CVS, pick up a prescription, and get a drink with some sugar in it because I feel shaky for some reason even though i just had lunch before the shakes never went away so i'm gonna get myself a sugary drink and go back home <laughs> all right so it's the next day now it's sunday hello it's bright um i'm at walmart i have madison with me over there <laughs> um chase and noah and greg are at home but i came out i need to get her i need to see if i could find her some boots for fall so that's why i wanted to bring her because i need her feet for that <laughs> and I have a whole bunch of other stuff that I want to get and I thought maybe I'll bring the camera out and show you guys if I find anything worth showing you so I wanted to say first that I'm at Walmart um I don't know we'll see if I take the camera out if not it's gonna be busy in there so I feel like I might get too stressed out for that and then I'll just show you what I got when we get home but just in case <laughs> so I'm trying to find all the cute clothes that everyone keeps talking about and saying that Walmart has so so far I don't know I think maybe I was in the wrong section before I've made it over to the time and true leggings section, which I have heard people talk about these a lot. Um, so I'm gonna get myself a pair, not those, and maybe those if I can find my size, but I'm getting a pair of the ones that just look like jeans. I'm getting a size medium, so hopefully they will fit. It's supposed to be, well, it's not focusing, but it's supposed to be eight to 10. What other, what other colors should I get? Should I get a different, I should get another one. I don't know. They have different colors. Purple, those are cute for fall. They got some really cute colors. I gotta pick a different color. Madison is super bored. Apparently she only wanted to come because she thought I was gonna look at toys. So, in the Halloween stuff, Halloween 
section. They have a lot of cute stuff. Skeleton. They have a lot of signs. They got this one. See, I got one of these a couple of years ago, but now I'm worried it's going to have mold on it. Maybe I should get a new one just in case. We got a little witch's hat. Pumpkins. These are cute. I think I, I got one that says boo on it, but I like mine better, but I'm scared it's going to be moldy. Oh. Black cat. I don't know what is wrong with me, like what it is about like shopping at stores now, but I just felt like so stressed out and like, I don't know, I just felt like scatterbrained, like like my brain was just going like, uh, like that, like the whole time we were in Walmart, like I don't know what it is, like I didn't used to have this problem, I used to be able to go shopping and it didn't matter how busy it was or anything, like I only had, no. keep your feet on your side. Or you're gonna get off the couch. I only had Madison with me too, and usually, like, if I only have her with me, it's fine because I'm not like watching like Chase or Noah. Like, she can just walk with me, and it's fine or whatever. Um, I don't know. Today, I just like could not. I couldn't even take it in the store. Really, we were looking at the Halloween stuff, and I was just like, I just want to get out of the store. I just want to be done. I was trying to decide what I should get, if I should get anything for Halloween, and then I didn't want to think about it anymore, and I just wanted to leave. So. I did get, ow, I got this little guy, Gracie quiet, we had a skeleton guy like this last year and he broke somehow so, you like him? Yeah. <laughs> I knew he would have fun with him, I might have to get another one because two would be better for two children who like to play with skeletons. So we just had some dinner. We had Pizza Hut. We haven't had Pizza Hut in like at least four years. Like it's been a really long time except for getting it at Target occasionally. Like you know those little pizzas that they sell there. So we got Pizza Hut. We went all out. I got like almost a meat lover's pizza. I got like a couple different meats on mine and we got like breadsticks and we were hoping, we, were, we thought it was gonna be like really good. And it wasn't even that great. It's like the pizza was kind of dry and it just like was a letdown. So that sucked. I don't know how much that cost, but it was probably at least 30 bucks, I'm sure. So yeah, don't you hate that when like you haven't had something in a really long time and you remember it being good and then you finally have it and then it's just like not good anymore. So I don't know, but we did get, we did get some dessert. Greg got a brownie thing, so maybe that will be good. But the kitchen is now a wreck, so I'm gonna clean this up quickly. And then I'll continue my story about Walmart and show you a couple things that I got. this clip yesterday but that was not working out with Chase trying to be in the video and everything um, but I think I started talking about or maybe I didn't even maybe I cut it out or whatever but yesterday at Walmart I don't know what it is but I just could not stand to be in the store anymore like I never used to be like this like I used to like it used to suck it used to suck going to a store if it was busy because it would just be like harder to shop and stuff like that with everybody around and everything but I don't know yesterday I just could not handle it like there was people Everywhere and every aisle we tried to go down there was people and I just felt so like scatterbrained and like Like I felt like my mind was going like a million different directions at once and I couldn't focus on what I wanted to get and I don't know And I just felt like super stressed out in the store like we were looking at the Halloween stuff And then I got to the point where I just didn't even care about looking at it anymore I was trying to decide what I should get if I should get anything for outside 
or whatever, and then I was just like, you know what, no, I don't even feel like thinking about this anymore, I'm just not gonna get anything. I did get like two things, but it wasn't for, it wasn't like outside stuff, it was just something simple or whatever, but I don't know. I feel, after I left Walmart yesterday, I just felt like I just want to do all of my shopping online, like, just everything. Like, as much as I possibly can, I'm just gonna order from Amazon so that I don't have to go to stores anymore. Um, but anyway, we got a calendar, I've been needing a calendar because I ran out of months, and then I got these two things because, well, Madison wanted one of these. She wanted, like, what is this? Is there two here? No. She wanted, like, bloody handprints for Halloween. I was like, that's gross. I'm not really that into Halloween. I don't really want bloody handprints somewhere, so we'll see where we're going to end up putting those. I got the cute ones. I picked out Happy Halloween with little happy little friendly ghosts and pumpkins. I thought that'd be cute for the front door or something. Um, and then I got some clothes. I did pick out a couple shirts, but I'm not even going to show you them. Um, I got home, tried them on, and they were totally bad. Number one, I didn't realize that the, the material was like mostly polyester. There was like no cotton in it at all. So first, they were like scratchy and just like not comfortable. Secondly, none of them like fit nicely. Like I need shirts that kind of like drape. Like I don't know if you can see this one, but it's kind of like drapey in the front to cover like my mom belly and everything. Those were just like clinging and not helping me at all. So I tried them on for like a half second and I was like, nope, and pulled it right back off. I was like, those are going back. All of them were like that. Um, I got Chase a bunch of shirts. I got him this one with a fire truck. Cars. I like to get him the shirts from Walmart because I've I've seen that they last, like they last an entire season and they're really cheap. I don't get him the sweatpants though. I've tried getting him like the sweats from there and those just like get really pitted really fast and they start to look terrible so now it has an airplane. So I got him four shirts and then for my leggings I'm going to be keeping two of them. I'm pretty happy with these. They were pretty comfortable and for like $12 they look like jeans and they got the pockets on the back so I don't know. I felt they, I felt like they looked all right. They weren't like fabulous or anything um, but I feel like they're good if I want to wear something other than a pair of black leggings if I want to look a little bit more like I'm wearing actual clothes. <laughs> and then I got a I got the olive ones and I have one more pair. I have these. These are like a tealy color and it's really pretty but these are the same size as the other ones. I got them all in mediums. These are way bigger like they're really stretchy. They just feel stretchy. I thought they were like a different kind of material but they're the same exact material. I don't know I guess that's just a Walmart like I don't know like they must have messed up a little bit on this one or something so I don't know, if you're going to shop for these and you have time, maybe try them on to make sure that they all fit the same because that did not fit. It was way too big. Um, maybe it would have shrunk, but I'm just going to return it because I think I only really need two pairs. But I'm happy with the two pairs that I'm going to keep. Mr. Noah is yawning over here next to me. Um, but yeah, I feel like that's all I wanted to show you. I just wanted to show you what I got. From Walmart, oh, I did get a skeleton guy, but whatever, you guys don't care. It's just a little skeleton. The kids, Chase and Madison like to play with the little skeletons. I'm probably going to have to go grab another one because I only got one. And I can see that not going well. Um, but, yeah, I think I'm going to wrap up, wrap up this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. My new haircut is already in a ponytail already, and it's like the shortest ponytail ever. Like... I can barely get it in a ponytail, so I think I'm going to want a little bit too short with my hair again, like last time. But whatever, I'll give it like a month or so and it'll probably be long enough. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys all in my next one. Bye.